Yeah, that'd be a great idea. Ah, well, see, there you go. Make sure you're not getting to the next beat too soon. Yep, he's trying, but you guys are lagging. From the top? Would you like pitches again? Yes, please. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, look up. Want to try again? You gave us two preps. You did it again. I did? Yep. Didn't he? You went, you went in just a little bit before. You prepped your three just a little bit. Okay, a lot of good stuff happening. Um, nice job. <clears throat> I think your hands can generally be a little lower. It's a lot in front of your face, so that a uh, little bit lower there. Um, on your rebound on one, <clears throat> you're going out to the side just a little bit too much instead of straight up. In addition, your rebounds on, th on two and three come back under instead of over. Yeah, so I'd like them, I'd like them to go over. So you get that little loopy kind of figure eight thing going. Yeah, and that's a good thing to practice. Right there, everyone. You can just practice starting and doing a, doing a figure eight with both hands. This will get this will get you into the habit of not going back under. You know, not doing this instead of this. You know, the smiley face. I don't want a smiley face. I want a figure eight. So figure eight. And if you're doing that, I think it'll become automatic. Yeah, maybe a little bit. So. Give us the first half of the tune or so, at least, and see if we can correct at least those things. How's your grip? Yeah, that looks good. That's a very nice starting position. Oh, you didn't feel yourself do that little move? Little move inside, didn't he? Try to go over the top. Keep going.
Okay, good. Um, you even gave me a nice ictus on the, uh, on the uh, very last note. Um, generally, those can be a little bit smaller here. They don't have to be quite so, quite so big with your wrist. Um, if you all, here's another concept for the ictus. is to keep it, keep it arm until you get down close. Hey, on a second. Keep it, keep it, keep it with your arm until you get down close. Here we are here, slow motion. You're here and now get within about an inch for what we're doing right now and flick it. So not not from here, but here. 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 So just practice that. You're getting used to it. hitting a point, hitting that plane, and just doing it from a short distance away. That's the idea. Not here. All arm for right now what we're doing. All arm until you get close. And then it's good. And then it's good. Real momentary and small. Very nice job. <laughs> You'll see on the on the video you actually you're, you're pretty much reverted to your yeah, it's, it's, my, yeah, it's just a habit. It's yeah. just a habit. It's just something you're gonna have to work on by working on that figure eight. Okay. Um, Can you start again and give us a breath? So where's the breath? Yeah. There you go. Got a, your ictus is, is really come a long way. Really good. Pattern looks really good. Um, just watch. I think we talked about this before with you. Make sure one goes uh, more up and not quite so much out. So I'd rather see it stay straight, kind of here in the middle. Your rebound of one. Okay. So up instead of out. Um, make, your hand has a slight tendency. Hands have a slight tendency to turn in when you're going in. So just just watch that. And keep your keep your palm down for now. But really, really nice. Yeah, really good. Really good. I'm, I'm not sure you gave us a breath even on your last go through. It's one of those things that's obviously not a habit. So yeah, yep. Don't forget. Uh, so you're you're a, you're a pianist, so that it's not doesn't come quite as um, naturally to you to, to breathe. But you know, think like a wind player. You know, I got to fill up with air or singer. I got to fill up with air here, and I'm going to show my choir group. Okay, really nice. Real quick. Um, I think your hand's just a little bit higher. Um, and, and yeah, keep in mind, if the, if the stand, by the way, is not comfortable for you, that's another thing you need to do on the podium before you start. Just make sure... Uh, that it's not going to obscure your hands, and you can still you can still read it. So probably a little bit higher than where. Yeah, that's better.
sure you give us an ictus on the last note too, so you come down. Um, you really got the idea of the ictus. What I'd like to see you do is make it a little bit more um, in a smaller space. Okay. In a smaller space because right now they, they're all really, the rebounds come immediately and they're always big. Um, your one is consistently way out here, the rebound for one, instead of up here. Yeah, it's, it's going it's going like that. Pretty consistently. Here, <laughs> stop. Here, and then um, here. Two is big. They're all and they come back in just a little bit too much. So keep them a little bit more localized. That's the word I'm looking for. Here, here, here. And make sure you, you make a concerted effort to go out after you do them. Hmm. Hmm. And you wait out there. And then you come back in, like it's drawing, like gravity is drawing you back in toward the next beat, instead of it's it's instead of it being so immediate. Just do a little bit of it, will you, please? <clears throat> Yeah, that's very, very much better, but it's really tough, isn't it, to make yeah. you make yourself do that? So you've obviously got a little habit of making them kind of bigger yeah. and stuff. Um, especially one <clears throat> needs to be right there in the middle and not go out this way. Yeah. Mm. 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 So it just needs to be more controlled. Um, especially, as, you know, we're in relatively sedate, moderato kind of tempo here. So that's what you want to project okay. from up there. You understand? Yeah. Because everything you're doing should have an effect on, on what your group's doing. The pattern looks very good. Very good. Localize those and it'll be really improved. Very nice. Since it, since it does ask us not to wear hats in here, I'm going to ask you to take your hat off. Thank you. I don't know what the deal with that is, but that's okay. I'd die for that here right now. slow down, don't they? You guys did a pretty good job of keeping up, but, but he was very patient with you. Um, take your time on your release. There was a little bit out of character with what went on before. It was a little bit of... Uh, yeah. My mind was elsewhere. I wasn't paying attention. I understand. So, um, generally, the pattern looks really good. The ictus, the ictus very nice. Um, position of the beats, very nice. Um, your, your hand turns in when you go in. So, just concentrate on keeping your palm down. Um, in addition, you're, 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 you're making a nice loop after three, but two consistently goes back under like the smiley face instead of the, instead of the figure eight. So just, just work on two, work on your hand turning in. Just start it up one more time. And there was something that was a little bit deceiving about your prep, I'm not sure. So give us an ictus on it. Can you give us a... A definite little flick. Do it one more. Do it one more time. Make sure you come over the top on three. Lower your hands just a little bit. 
That's better. Try to go over the top on two. take your time and, and make the your, your your release doesn't have to be any bigger than your beats so what what I saw there was here pretty good and then like a real big thing which would kind of make me think I might need to swell if I was singing or playing the yeah. so just keep it keep it calm and in character with what's gone before really good looking pattern um, really coming along looks really good really good those are just details You guys look better than some conductors I've seen making a living. Oh, what'd you do? You looked at your hands. Yeah, that doesn't give us a feeling of confidence. We're going, oh no, she's looking at her hands. So start again, please. Instead of what that's gone, so it's going one, two, down. And even, even on two, one, two, down. So nice and, nice and smooth. Doesn't she have a nice exit? She does. <laughs> okay. Maybe elbows out just a little bit. So, yeah, hands. There you go. That looks nice. Okay, very nice. Um, uh, you, you made those improvements. Good job. Um, your, I think your hand can be, the tip of your baton needs to come down a little bit. So to do that, um, keep your wrist from, from going up like this. Keep it a little bit more straight out from your arm so that you've got a plane right here and it's not, it's not going up. 
Um, just show me your starting position, please. Oh, your hand also looks looks like it's doing that a little bit. So it, it just should it should be comfortable and natural and relaxed. There you go. Uh, let's see who else. Luke, are you up? Am I next? Or you guys already? Um, okay. They've already I'm gone. They were in class. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I'm just, just kidding. <laughs> I'm a task. I'm a stern taskmaster. One of the meanest teachers you'll ever have. Give us that last note again, and can you do the, the thing and, and the hold? Do, kind of do oh, it yeah. as a fermata, just for argument's sake. Okay. So it's just the last, just give us the last note. Not just give us a C. C. Yeah, yeah. I, it, it's, what it, it's what we've been doing. So okay. The other way is obviously the way it's written, so that's fine, too. Um, uh, pattern looks good. Ixuses look really good. Um, once you lowered your hands, I think it was a little bit more relaxed. Up here in your face, it's not quite as okay. relaxed looking. Um, the only thing I see is, is uh, your, your, your ictus changes the time a little bit over to your left uh, on two. So two is like this. Exact, and you can start going off on your own and, and doing stuff. But it's kind of like learning how to do Bach chorale harmony before you do. Okay. Good. Good job. Yes, sir. You have mouthed the words. What is your opinion on that? Uh, if you're if you're doing a doing a choir piece with a choir, I don't, I don't think there's anything wrong with that. Um, it can. I think it can only help. And I'm not a choral conductor having done some choir work, but um, how many of you are used to seeing the conductor uh, conduct with and mouthing the words? I mean, generally, if it's, a, if it's a monophonic, you know, if it's a monophonic thing and everybody's doing the same words, I'd say it's generally helpful. So, yeah, okay. it's fine. <clears throat> Do you know what you did before you started? What'd she do? 
Um, maybe there's a little bit of that, but e even before that, you, you look down. You had your hands up and you looked down. So, yeah, I know it's, it's, there's a hundred things to think about, but if you don't, I, I just have to mention them because otherwise they become habits. No, oh, that's okay. Why don't you start, start with your hands down. You can stay up on the podium. Get comfortable. Put your feet together just a little bit more. There you go. It looks more powerful. You're standing there like this. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what this is. And we really haven't talked about the feet. But if, you're, if your feet are together, I, th I, th I think, it's my opinion, it presents a more confident, um, impulse-driven uh, stance. So you look like you look like you're, you know, ready to command. Okay. Keep it smooth. No subdivides. Do me, do me, a, do me an experiment. Do, do me an experiment. Um, I, I can see you bouncing with the beat. Try to keep your body still, and see if that helps from from making the extra subdivides. Because you're still, I can see when you're. Your body's kind of going along with it too. This is an exaggeration, but that's, and you can feel it. When I say subdivide you, you know exactly what I'm talking about, don't you? Okay, so try to, try to keep really still and just move your arms. <clears throat> you. Start one more time. You're going to give us three, right? <laughs> So can you feel yourself doing the subdivides? Can you? So it's just hard to get, uh, uh, it really, I think all it's gonna take is just, is just maybe, and maybe this, maybe this pattern will help you. Maybe push your hand off yourself. Just use your hands, keep, keep your hands nice and loose. And now don't ever, don't ever stop moving. Now. Your hands, good. So the point of that is your hands should be as expressive as you can. So you should be smiling and systematic. Back to the hands and stuff. You know, where it stops. That's how it boosts your subdivides, is where it stops. Yep. 
I'm sorry, one more time. Let me, let me stop you. Show me your starting position again. This elbow can be out just a little bit more. Right elbow. There you go. Now they're kind of even. Relax your right hand. Relax your right hand. There you go. Now pull your elbow up. There you go. Continuous motion. Good. It's better already. It's better already. So I you, you know you're having to concentrate really hard to do it right now, but you know, sit around just just doing that all the time. I think it'll 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 come. I know it will. I know you can get it. Your pattern looks good otherwise. Watch that you come over the top on two instead of back underneath. Over the top. One, two, three. You understand the difference? You know what you're doing? Okay, good. Is that it? That's it. That's everybody, right?